Well, Selkirk came down to Mansfield Park brim full of confidence after their great start to the season. They came up against a white side stung into action themselves by their own poor campaign so far. Rory Hutton at standoff was a catalyst for Hoyk and they produced six tries, Hutton in most of the moves. The tries came from McNeil with two, Rennick, Campbell, Coots and Hutton himself. For Selkirk, David Cassidy kept the scoreboard turning with five penalty goals, but it wasn't enough. A temporary halt to the Selkirk machine, but Hoyk at last have shown us what they can do. Yeah, obviously delighted with the victory this afternoon. Um, you know, there was a lot of chat about Selkirk coming to Hoyk and what they were going to do. And uh, you know, they won this great run. They were full of confidence. But uh, I think we've proved that um, Division One's a hard place, um, and you have to fight for every game. And we were desperate today. And I, I thought the boys played extremely well. Six tries to nil. The scoreboard will tell you. And uh, I think, apart from giving away some silly penalties in the first half, we let them in the game. We, um, we kept it. The, the three points in the second half and they never crossed the line for a try so all those things um, are very encouraging um, but it's not really about soccer day it was about us and our performance in our home game and we had to get a win and we did Viking Direct great value offer supplies delivered to your door fast with Viking you're in safe hands